What's up? Welcome back, Enchanters, to another unboxing. And yes, we have the exclusive Catwoman by Batman the Animated Series from Mondo. And I'm so excited. At the time of this filming, this piece is still surprisingly available for purchase on Mondo's website, so go check it out. Uh, I believe the exclusive... Oh, Lord, I'm the worst here. Um... As for price point, I think it's, don't, don't ask me, man. Don't ask me. I'm just going to put it up right over there. <laughs> That's the price. So I do know it's only like a $15 difference. And surprisingly, they still have this piece. It was released in late 2021. And um, it's still available, um, which is really surprising. And unlike some of the other exclusives, there's no addition size to it either. Uh, Mondo typically will put in an addition size. It does not have an addition size. So if I had to take a guess, I would say it's, a, I would guess it's about a thousand. Um, but I, again, I still don't know. <laughs> um, I'm so excited to unbox this because if you already know, you know Catwoman is my all time favorite uh, villain slash heroine slash just just icon when it comes to any um, Marvel or DC characters. Rogue and Catwoman, I mean, those are my girls and I'm so excited to unbox this. And again, my favorite era of Catwoman was Tim Burton's Batman Returns, Michelle Pfeiffer's adaptation, and also Selena Kyle. Uh, in um, the animated series as well. So, so excited to unbox this with y'all. Um, I can't wait. Before we dive in, let me introduce myself. My name is Jean-Pierre Bon Jovi. I'm a collector at heart of anything 90s related. And if you're happening to come across this video through the YouTube algorithm, it would mean the absolute world to have you subscribe. So hit that smash button below to stay connected with us. I unbox, uh, I bring you unboxings and reviews every Monday. Um, 90s related items, you name it. If it's from the 90s, probably I'm gonna unbox it here from action figures, toys, statues, maquettes, you name it, we unbox it here. Uh, so without further ado, let's dive into this bad boy. So um, the, bo the, art, the box is really, really, really small. I took the liberties to already open it prior uh, to having it on camera to save us some time here. Freaking gorge. Let's set this aside. <gasps> yes, it's a much well actually it's the size of the 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 um the Batman Deluxe with just one of those boxes. So it's it's not that it's that that much smaller. Um I'm so excited, it looks amazing. Uh so here is the Mondo exclusive holographic sticker. So whenever the piece is an exclusive. They always make two edition sizes when they release typically any piece. They make an exclusive and a non-exclusive. And the exclusive will come with like an additional one, two, three, four pieces. Um, so excited to show you what the exclusives are in this piece. Oh my god, I'm so excited. So she also has a Velcro opening. Yeah, let's take that out. Yes. Now, this features her in her first... Uh, the first very episode of Batman the Animated Series was, I believe, called The Red Claw. Um, so this is her in the Red Claw series. So you're going to see a lot of a lot of um, references to that. And that's what I love about Mondo is the attention to detail. So you're going to notice that all the accessories, the pieces, how they fit and work, uh, follow through particular episodes. And I believe they capture in two episodes here. I do know the Red Claw is being featured here, but she has like one or two additional accessories that are featured in her later episodes in the animated series. So let's dive in. <laughs> what do you look like? Don't tell me uh, you're my very own private probation officer. How often would you like me to check in, Catwoman? That's hilarious. Oh my God, you look freaking amazing. <gasps> Wow. Yeah, I'm already seeing a lot of things from that episode reference. With the exception of two items, they're all from that reference. Look how freaking bomb that looks. That is absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Wow, 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 wow. We are going to open this um, in a moment, and I'm going to show you an in-depth view of all the pieces, what it comes with. I cannot wait to unbox this with y'all. 
So let's go ahead, dive in, and let's see all the articulation, all the accessories, the references, because I'm so excited. All right, so here she is unboxed, and she looks freaking amazing. So like the Batman exclusive, as mentioned before, she is going to come with her base, the Batman logo base, um, and they do have that clip. Um, which is, again, she, you can secure her. You don't necessarily need this at all to position her or pose her. Uh, she can stand on her very own without the need of the base, which is something I do appreciate from these Mondo pieces as I figure that out right there. So, incredible. Again, look how amazing the detail on this piece is. Again, you do have that cell shading, which you're noticing a little bit more on Catwoman than you do on Batman. A lot on the side, her yellow belt. And here we have one of the two whips. So this one is already fixed and positioned like so. Doesn't really have much move, but I love that she's grabbing it here. This would be something like, you know, if... I wish she had a clip of some sort where we can keep the... That's my one, one negative so far, is I wish we had something here, like a magnet. I wish it was magnetized, and you can keep this particular whip right on her side belt. That would be freaking iconic. That is not a possibility with this piece, but... Let's dive into the articulation before we dive into the, all the extra pieces. So her head does have a 360. Um, her bust area here uh, does have a give. There goes the belt. Um, and then her torso as well also has a give. You do have to be mindful that the belt is also right here. So there is a slight give there as well. I feel like the belt should be a little lowered. And it is not. So it's kind of just like there. I'm not sure if that's just my piece in particular, but yeah. I'm pretty sure if I lift this up a bit, I'll be able to position this closer to this area. Um, her legs, again, you have that click, which I love as well. Uh, does have a lot more give than Batman does, that's for sure. Um, what I do love about this is she has this little her joints, so she is double jointed, which is awesome. Uh, but there's also rotation, which I really like as well. So you have that. As for her feet, she does have so she does have a give up and down. It does rotate as well, side to side as well, which is pretty awesome. So love, 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 love that. When we go up to her arms, they do do a 360 at the elbow, also does a 360, which I appreciate as well. Following that, um, so she is just have that double joint on the elbow. Her wrist as well are going to move back and forth and appreciate that. Now I do have our claws on and I have two different hands, so I have this one and I have this one right over here. So these um, these actually I added to her prior to doing the video. These are not the ones that she comes with. She does come with the closed fist, which we're going to look in a moment. And I will say this is my favorite portrait of the f of the three. This is my favorite. Um, I just love this more serious face. Uh, I'm going to show you the others in a moment as well. So let's position her back here. And now let's dive into all these pieces. All right, so what we're gonna start off with first is the exclusives. So you're gonna get her Selena Kyle portrait. This is exclusive for, I think it's like five bucks more. I think it's five bucks. I don't think it's 15 bucks. I think it's like five bucks more gets you the exclusive. And at the time of the filming, which is February of 2023, it's still available. So definitely go with the exclusive. It's so rad. And of course, iconic. Um, Catwoman was featured on the very first episode of Batman, the animated series. You're going to get Isis. And this is exclusive only to this. So you get two Isis, but this is the exclusive. So with the exclusive, um, he's able to be positioned right by her, by behind her neck. 
which is freaking amazing, y'all. I love that so much. So those are the two exclusive pieces that come with this. You're also going to get, she comes with two closed fists. So this is the closed fist. As I showed you before, these are the other, the left and the, uh, the claws. One is the open hand, one is the slightly clenched hand. What I love about this hand, it's going to give you the ability to hold this, which looks like it's a bag of gemstones or diamonds, which I love that. Also, I love this to hold the open whip as we were, as I was showing you before, the, the closed whip as well. A few other accessories that, uh, again, all these accessories come with all, both the exclusive and the original, is this cell shaded diamond and the necklace that she steals literally within the first minute of the episode. This, this necklace actually makes an additional feature in another episode, <laughs> uh, but pretty rad. And you can place this on her as well. You can remove her head and place this on her, which I think is also pretty rad. Um, you are going to get her, these are not binoculars. This is, it's like a binocular, but it's actually her photo. It's a, it's a camera. So she's able to snap pictures with it. This is also featured in the first episode, which is so rad. You're going to get her open hands. So these don't have the claws on them. These are my least favorite. And then you're going to get the semi-closed hand. This allows her to pick up her other whip. So this whip is awesome. So if you want to create a scene, this whip does have, you know, it's more malleable. It's not stiff at all. It doesn't stick in a specific uh, position, but you can create a, you know, an Instagrammable, uh, Instagrammable pic or have her like, you know, uh, fly or use it from, I don't know, from skyscraper to skyscraper, maybe create like a fun little image. So do appreciate that as well. You're also going to get the regular Isis. This comes in both of them. So you're going to get standard Isis and you're going to get two of her head sculpts. So you're going to get this one, which is my least favorite head sculpt. It's like a derpy derp. I don't know why I just don't like this head sculpt at all. I don't care for it that much. And you're going to get this one where she's smiling. Um, so it's kind of cunning and I, I actually like this one, but I like the one that I have on her a lot more. And last but certainly not least, you're going to get Batman's <laughs> handcuffs. So Batman handcuffs her at the end of the episode, uh, which is pretty awesome. So you are going to get that. Oh, sorry, Isis. You are going to receive that and you can have her handcuffed. So you just remove the joints on both of her hands. So let's do that right now. All right. So I attempted to put these on. I did see someone else, someone who was able to put these handcuffs on her. It is possible. You'd have to remove this hand, but it's very, very, very challenging. It's really not conventional or ideal. I wish there was a little... There needed to be a little bit bigger of a gap in order for this to really be ideal, but it really isn't. As you can see, once you get the hand in, it's very much possible, but it's very uncomfortable. And only like from this position. Um, I even tried the back, but it just doesn't. It doesn't give from the back. Uh, it wouldn't be possible if we, if we did that. Uh, as you can see, there is no way that give is going to... You see that? It just doesn't. So even above her, above her head is even worse. So only from the front, but again, it is a little challenging and, um, I'm pretty sure I could have figured out, but I lost patience. <laughs> so there you have it. So overall, I have to say, I, a lot of people gave this Catwoman, um, not the most positive reviews in comparison to the other Mondo Batman pieces. I do have to say, she is of the Batman exclusive and Catwoman. I have to say, I like her a lot more. She's a lot more uh, posable. Uh, uh, I, outside of the handcuffs, which I'm not a fan of, everything else was freaking awesome. I absolutely love and love the nods to all the episodes. Um, and knowing where this all came from and most of this, all of this, for the exception of this piece right here, was featured all in episode one of Batman the Animated Series and same with this stone as well. So for the exception of this, um, everything was featured in episode one, which I think is pretty rad as well. I absolutely am obsessed. Now again, this is a one six size and four size comparison. Your traditional action figure will be like one tenth that size. Uh, and again, she's 
massive, y'all. She is massive. So not for all collectors. Now, I believe she retails for like $185, the exclusive, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, that's not including shipping. Though sometimes Mondo does do free shipping, um, but honestly, I, I don't I don't recall what I paid for that, whether they added shipping or not. But she is absolutely just gorgeous and iconic to the animated series. I think it's just it's such a stellar piece, and I cannot wait for y'all to see the next one. We have the Joker coming up, and yell that piece. I cannot wait to unbox it. It's going to be spectacular. So let me know, comment below what your thoughts are on the Mondo figures. I think they're absolutely breathtaking. They're not for everyone. The price points, you know, they're, they, they come with a very high price point, very large sticker price. But then again, they are freaking sexy and rad. And because they're so large, they're not also for all collectors either. But I think this is just like, this is it. This is... This is like the creme de la creme when it comes to action figures. If you're going to own any, God, it has to be these. They're amazing. Um, and you can avoid any, you know, one-tenth scale figures because this right here is just superior. <laughs> so let me know. Comment below what your thoughts are. Stay tuned for the Joker. And then we have uh, Mr. Freeze, which is arriving uh, this week as well, which I'm so excited I was able to find him on ebay so 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 excited i got the exclusive uh so can't wait to unbox that have an incredible one y'all keep collecting don't forget to hit that smash button and subscribe and until the next one enchanters over and out